Hey everyone, Margaret here. Final Fantasy XIV's first expansion, Heaven's Ward, is coming out on June 23rd. There's a lot of neat stuff coming along the way that you might not have been aware of, so let's take a look at what you can expect to see. The expansion will send players to the northern portions of Eorzea, ushering in the next chapter of the game's ongoing storyline. The story is a big part of Final Fantasy XIV, and the current storyline ended on a major cliffhanger, with players essentially exiled and in need of refuge. Ishgard will be taking players in, but they'll have to contend with the ongoing war against the dragons and their allies. In order to take on an army of dragons, you're going to need new skills. The game's level cap is being raised to 60, bringing along with it a slew of new skills for every class. Paladins and warriors get new DPS options for being off tanks. White mages and scholars get new healing effects. And all DPS jobs are receiving major updates and new skills changing your familiar rotations. Or perhaps you want to strut around in one of the three new jobs added for the expansion. All three jobs start at level 30, and like other jobs, your character can swap into these roles just by changing their weapon. The Dark Knight expands the tanking roster, with a heavy focus placed on MP management in contrast to other tanks in the game. Dark Knights can charge into battle, leaping to engage enemies, and drawing in targets with the power of darkness. Astrologians expand our healing options, offering two different stances for healing one focused on regenerative heals and the other around erecting temporary health barriers. They buff allies by drawing random cards and combining the effects, allowing buffs to be applied to party members that offer boosts to damage, attack speed, defense, and more. Lastly, Machinists are another ranged damage class, focused around planting secondary turrets for buffs and damage while carefully managing their special ammunition. Players will have access to a variety of proc effects in battle as they shoot down enemies and steadily reload. Now if you need a break from combat, the game's gathering and crafting classes are getting an expanded endgame in the expansion, with specialization options for crafters and a new currency system known as scripts for high-end crafting and gathering gear. And of course, there are huge new areas to explore with the addition of flying mounts. Not to mention that it wouldn't really be a Final Fantasy game without new places to explore. From elegant runes to technological facilities. Final Fantasy XIV Heaven's Ward is going to be available for PC, PlayStation 3, and PlayStation 4. It launches on June 23rd, but early access starts on June 19th for players who pre-order the expansion. The game requires a monthly subscription and, of course, a working internet connection. Are you hyped for Heaven's Ward? What's your favorite part of the expansion? Let us know in the comments section below. Margaret signing off. Enjoy the game.